we'll go ahead and probably, I want to say, we'll do that to take out one of them. Actually, you know what? A hammer would actually be more useful. Maybe. Let's try this. We'll try that. I need to jump maybe twice now, and then to take out the sombrero guy. Hmm. I'm trying to decide what would be good. I would say maybe double hop slippers. That might actually be one of our best things. Or double e-camera. Hmm, the e-camera's not really good. Fuck, let's do this before our time runs out. And hopefully this will do exactly what I want. I'm hoping to at least kill and, uh, there we go, not be killed. So this should hopefully kill him. Oh, it's not going to kill him, is it? It's not going to fucking kill. Damn it. Okay. Oh, please let this one do it. I don't want to waste... He's going to run away. <laughs> All right. This guy's not dying either. I, I planned this out all wrong. There we go. Okay, maybe that'll kill him. <laughs> Oof. All right. <laughs> Camera. <laughs> okay, so their health's going to come back. That's great. I mean, fantastic news for all of us, right? And I think if we use a buddy, they run away. Except, God, how the fuck do we get to him? I've done it before. It's easy, but I'm just doing horrible with the execution. What, a regular Koopa Troopa? All right, we'll do this one. We'll get rid of that second guy. And... Oh, I had a triple jump. Damn it. All right, let's try this. Let's see if this is worth anything. And actually, fuck. I should probably do just a contingency thing. I've been having some really bad luck with these guys, obviously. Let's, uh, let's try that. All right, that was a train wreck. <laughs> Better not jinx myself. Boom. Jump. And that kills him. I wasted two fucking cards for nothing. <laughs> for being overprotective, overthinking. Fantastic. So thanks for all this stuff. Now, let me kill another one of you. Wow. Okay. That They literally had no popping up animation. They were just there from one frame to the next. Insane. And now we've got this. Beautiful. You're going to make all of your friends much more tough. Okay, so if we decide to use a thing immediately, we'll get rid of everyone except for the sombrero, and then all of our next attacks will kill him. Okay. That will work. So, is there something we haven't used yet? Pretty sure the light would be pretty decent. Um, but actually, let's use the replica now that I think about it. We'll use that. We'll jump a couple times, just in case we didn't kill all of them for some godforsaken reason. I mean, you never really can tell with fucking replicas. But they're being skewered to death, so I find it hard to believe that anyone would survive that. So Sombrero Guy pisses off. He's like, oh, I am out of here, man. Sounds like the Luigi voice. <laughs> Oof. <sighs> okay, and it didn't quite kill, so of course it didn't. Of course it didn't. Alright, uh, at least this will do it. The triple jump, thank god I had that. Boom. Alright. And this guy also gets to get jumped on, too. I don't think he's gonna die. I think he's gonna run away, because he's a schmuck. There we go. <laughs> oh, wait, maybe not. Two excellents? There we go. Just half expecting a nice there. Ooh, no, he's alive. He is alive. And well, goddammit. By the straws of his goddamn sombrero, he lives. Damn it. <laughs> Lucy got that perfect bonus. You know what? I kind of want, like, redemption on that. Where you can give me the Koopa Paratroopa. Two of them. Woo! Okay, almost fell there. You know what? I don't need to deal with this. I don't care. I'll just kill you right here. There we go. <laughs> As he was doing absolutely nothing to instigate this. Alright, so that's good. That does a whole lot of damage. Maybe we'll do the same thing here, and we'll just use another item, another thing. Or he'll just power himself up. Maybe this is where I killed him. Because <laughs> I just didn't want to take any more chances. Okay. So, we know that he does not like being stomped on. I wonder if we can pow block him. Okay. So we have that. Uh, double hammers would work, and probably double iron jump. I feel like I'm running dangerously low on items. <laughs> Alright, here we go. 
This is like the first thing I should have done. Like, just cripple him so he can't run away. It's like, yeah, you can survive longer, but... Look at it! That was it! He's not hard, he just runs away like a little bitch every time. God, I really hope I don't have to collect his... his card. That'd be really nice. Once you finish this level, uh, you will always be able to refight these guys. It's not really spoilers, but you eventually do come back and yeah. Wait, don't peel me off just yet. First, allow me to introduce myself. <laughs> Count number 35, reporting for duty. All right, cool. You can peel me off now. There you go. Sweet. See ya. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm sure you appreciated it. Okay, so for a block, we have to make our way all the way to that barrel and uh, avoid these guys. It's not really hard to dodge them. As you guys can tell how much trouble I was already having just attacking them. There we go. And we are good. Because I guess that's how much these rolling things were rolled up by. I guess they were all rolled together. Anyways, uh, it looks like they're kind of posing there for a while. How's it going, friends? Oh! <laughs> ah, don't move a muscle! <laughs> oh god. If you move, we'll shoot. Please don't do that. Please don't do that. <laughs> oh, there we go. I moved. So we get into a nice fight with an orgy of uh, Sniffits, as well as that asshole who makes them all tougher. Rude. How dare you? How dare you? Alright. Well, I guess we can use another thing here and do our previous, I guess, uh, works. Actually, you know what? Fuck, I should have gone back and gotten a spike. Or at least a spiny. Ay. That was my bad. Alright, so what? Have, we haven't seen the light bulb yet. I hope that kills. If it doesn't, that would be really unfortunate, because I'm going to hopefully uh, murder the heck out of this guy. And we'll try. Maybe we'll do this. We'll make sure they're all in on the action. I wonder if we can crumple the sombrero guy, if we would be able to do things to him. <laughs> like things, like actual things. Uh, here, let's use a fire flower, I guess? No, he'll run away for that. I have nothing good. Everything I own is in shambles. We'll go with that. Okay. Let's get this excellent and, uh, yep, he runs away for the pal. Why does he run away there? That's so bizarre. He's gonna run away. I don't really care much, but it's annoying. Oof. <laughs> Imagine getting brighted to death. <laughs> That'd be insane. Alright, so he's gonna be, yep, doing that nonsense. Ooh, an excellent might have been able to kill him. Yeah, he's like, oh god, concussion. Okay, so you're done. God, I didn't realize those guys were actually kind of challenging to take out with my current card set. Usually, I'm super loaded, but I don't pick up everything, so. Anyways, it's Rescue Squad members, 36 and 39. Cool. So they're gonna go back. Where's like 32 through like 3? Still need to get those guys, right? Yeah, yeah, man. God, who knows that was that bad? Also, check it out. We got the trunky for the thing that we deserved. Awesome. So let's go pull this off, and we're gonna go over here. And actually, I don't want to backtrack. Let's go this way first. This is, I think, the beginning of the line. Oh, but there's so many of these guys here. How's it going? I can speak to you and not murder you, right? <laughs> There we go. What a tough noggin. <sighs> Logan always felt out so much smoke it makes it hard to see, not to mention the environmental impact. <laughs> okay, Al Gore, we did it. If you were to elect me, Goomba, as Supreme Leader, I would be environmentally friendlier than your current Supreme Leader. Cool. Pretty sure that's foreshadowing Trump, but what do I know? We shovel the coal, breathing in harmful toxins that were covered in smoke and ash. All while Mr. Larry just chills. Typical manager. <laughs> that David out of here. <laughs> Whenever I see the exhaust funnel on an engine, I get a weird urge to stuff something in it. I don't know what this says about me in his face while he says that. But if I plugged it, the smoke would stop coming out and I'd get into trouble with Mr. Larry. Hmm. I like to plug things in with my plumbery things, correct? What about you? How's it going, Mr. Shy Guy? Mr. Larry has a good taking a trip on a luxury train and getting it, getting to eat delicious hand-hammered meats. My god, that was a difficult sentence. Anyways, it's Koopa so depressed. 
One day I'll settle down, maybe near a pond, have a couple of kids, and kiss this fool's life goodbye. In the meantime, ah, just hope that job that was promised to me, <laughs> I'll be able to get there, and I don't get confused by any literary artists, I guess. <laughs> we should take some time to chat with them. Bad guys are people, too. Oh, alright. Later, nerds! Code number 42. You're a dick. Also, awesome. Tact. Do you know it? Apparently not. You've come all this way. Why don't you sit down and rest a while? You know, this thing's really tempting, but I guess so. How's it going? Mario, please lend me your ear for just a moment. Don't you ever wish that you could escape from the hardships of your everyday life? Take us, for example, out of nowhere, with no notice. We're ordered to attack the train works, or attack the kitchen. No rhyme or reason. Mario, every obstacle you've experienced has been the result of our hard and thankless work. I hope the guys upstairs realize just how much we actually do. Maybe next time I'll just give them a straw and tell them to get to work. I sit here and look out of this window at the evening sky. We're not at the end of the every day wishing that I could just go to some faraway place. But I understand the reality. I'm in Bowser's army for life, so I'll just have to give up on my dreams. Mario, I'll probably be ordered to attack you someday. And we'll be bad guy versus good guy. There's no point in arguing to ourselves. Blind. Thanks for listening. Mario, I'm sure we'll meet again. Maybe as enemies. Aw, poor shy guy. I think he disappears, too. <laughs> like, out of this cart. It's kind of sad. Anyways, how's it going? The engine's just ahead, but we can't get to it from here. God damn it. Alright. Well, I was wondering why there was a safe block up there. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. <laughs> Toad number 34. Excellent. Thank you so much. Okay. So, we're gonna go ahead and make our way back. Because, uh, we can get to the roof from over here. That's good. Well, we should also investigate that very strange, uh, luggage that was over there. It was locked and we found the key to the trunk. So, I'm assuming that's what it goes to. I mean, that's just me making an ass out of you and me. So we'll jimmy it in there, and oh my god, finally we're free! It was really cramped with 30 of us in there. God, what's the point of even, like, giving you 44 fucking toads? Since I've been separated from my captain, I'll report back. Sweet, see you guys later. <laughs> what? God, I'm starting to lose my voice. This has been a long recording day, so... I apologize, but we just need to get this orange star and we'll be back on track. Okay, so I'm gonna avoid the sombrero guy. I don't even actually. You're the only one, aren't you? Let's just, let's just take care of him. We'll just call it good. That'll be the last fight before we do anything here. And I should probably go back and fill up my my cards. Except I think we're probably mine. All right. So you're gonna soup yourself up. Um. So. I can use a pow block on you, right? This is definitely a thing I can do. I will, I'll do that. I'll try the pow block, and then I'll step on you. Because <laughs> you seemed to die really quickly the last time, right? We'll try that. If not, then I just opened up my inventory for a little bit. So that I can free it to play around with it in the next episode. And then we'll just meet back up where we started. Yeah, see? We just have to crumple him. We just need to make him be the last one there. Hmm. I guess maybe if in that last fight with all of those sniffets, I just went ahead and I did the pow block second, we would have been able to kill him. So I guess that makes sense. 